Here comes the shot. And that is a brilliant score. Aidan Farker from Mahari in County Armagh comes forward from left corner back and scores a splendid point. Really good. That's a savage, Isn't savage it? strike the ball. Coming through the middle is John Daly. On his shoulder to his left is Killian McDay. This is very good. Opportunity for Sean Kelly brought down. And surely that's going to be a penalty. Brilliantly worked move by Galway. Crucial moment in Carrick and Shannon. Shane Walsh facing Ethan Rafferty. Here he comes. Galway against Armagh. And Ethan Rafferty saves this time. Fine goalkeeper. Diving to his left, gathering it into his body. Matty Tierney being confronted by Kieran Higgins. Tierney just taking his eye off him momentarily. Back there helping out his defence is Conor Turbot. Full marks to him. Comes back into the centre for us, Sean Kelly. He was the one that created the penalty of the move. And away he goes again. The gap has opened up. Here comes a shot. Oh, brilliant. brilliant Sean Kelly. His first goal in the championship 2023. Now that's a footballer. That's a leader. That's a man who can defend and attack. Superb. Oh, what a man to carry a football. Sean Kelly take a bow, seen half a gap, went for it, kept going the whole way and finished it with, with a plum off the long kick out, which Armagh had forced Gleeson to take by pressing up. Uh, and critical, massive, massive score just the last few minutes. But Sean Kelly, uh, what a man, what a season. We just thought the psychological edge had swung Armagh's way, and Stefan Campbell is dropping this in. And that equally is a great response by Armagh. We have a game in Carrigan Shannon. Sean Kelly. Created the penalty. Scored the goal. Not a bad day's work for a number three. Peter Cook doing what number 12 should be doing. Now that is a brilliant score. Simplicity in motion. But it is what wing forward should be doing from way out the field. Took a step inside and hit it sweetly. Jason Duffy. Rory Grugan. He's going to go for it. Dropping it in, but it's not curling. It is now. And it's touched over the bar. It got there. It looked like it was sailing to the right and wide. But the Armagh fans will be pleased with the long ball strategy here. Paul Conroy, nice ball inside, great ball to Matty Tierney, who crept inside the Armagh cover to get his second point of the game. Rain starting to pile down, people heading for cover, no such luck for the players on the pitch, but that time somebody on the Armagh team forgot to look behind them. Armagh there in numbers, John Marr, Peter Cook, and he's swinging back into the midfield area, the hopping ball is Michael, and it works towards Armagh. Can they produce a winner here? Twisting, turning. It's Andrew Moynan. He's past the 45. They're all chasing him. Half of Galway is chasing him. He's brought to ground and surely that is a free. And Joe McQuillan has given a free to Armagh. Uh, just brilliant play by Andrew Moynan. Probably a soft enough free, to be honest. Not a huge amount in it at all. Armagh have never beaten Galway in the championship. This is the fifth occasion. He nods the head. He concentrates. Focus. Kicks. And the crowd, reaction says it all. Our goal went beaten. Galway have to go forward to try and get an equaliser. The MR fans in front of us in the commentary box are all standing on their feet. Rain or no rain. Sleet or sunshine, they don't care. They want to beat Galway. Inside first, the left half back, Kian Hernan. Was he fouled? The referee is given a free. And yet, as you change the chapter, as the page turns, Kieran McGinney is adamant the time is up. But there's an opportunity for Galway to draw the game again for the 12th time as the challenge came in with Kieran Hernan. Shane Walsh kicking it very high. He's not going to reach the target. Let's see what happens now. Ball is cleared out. Comes out whistle! Omar have beaten Galway in the championship for the very first time. You'd swear they've won the All-Ireland. No cup has been won.